Hello everyone, are you ready for another adventure? It's me, Woki, and I'm here with my brother Nux. Hello! Our cat Lucifer is somewhere on the bottom of the floor, trolling. Rubbing against our legs. Rubbing against the legs, because it's time to do some more high difficulty quests. So similar to how we've done the other challenge quest, I will lay out the rules for you right here. There will be some changes from the last time we did it. So we will typically have one shot at this. The reason being is that I don't have very much time. So we only really have <laughs> legitimately one shot to fight all these bosses. We will look to see what they do. First by reading what it says in here what they do. And then if we don't understand, looking at it a little bit deeper. And then we will be building a team. Me picking first and then my brother picking first. And then in the next video, my brother would pick first and then go there. And that's how the team build is going to go. So there's going to be a lot of janky teams. The The success rate of how how our, how good are we are we building a team that actually wins, very low. I want to say it's like usually two out of seven we is... Did, we did pretty good on EO. It was like neck and neck at the It's end. true, but that was also us with multiple tries going for it. In terms of the one-shot tries, it's <laughs> it usually does not end very well for us. Well, it's harder. It was harder because uh, we don't really do challenge quests unless yeah. it's like yeah for the lores we yeah. never did it for recording yeah and a lot of these challenge quests are also supposed to be on the second try you have a better idea of how to do it and then you beat it we're trying in literally first try go if we get hit by a random crit and we die then we die that's oh, well. just the way it is like that one fight where we had no the hijikata it happened in eos when we said let's bring in hijikata and hijikata, hijikata got smoked <laughs> two and, seconds but into when the hijikata video. lived he did the work. Exactly. But that's an example of us winning through multiple tries. This is all going to be one-shot tries. So yeah, that's going to be today's video, and that's going to be the next set of videos coming up. But remember that going in there before you uh, start saying things that will hurt my feelings about how bad I am at the game. I'm aware. So let's go in first. The first one going against the leash you win. The no second, no strike. second strike. Okay. About exhibition quest, our oh, ultra high difficulty. For, uh, to clear them. You said, no, no, you can't use your quartz to get this one done. Okay, so before we set up a party one, huh? I'll, I'll just go click on one of these to see what his buff is. So strategy hint, the enemy will consume key uh, to use... Chi, my bad, it's Chi. Yeah. To use powerful skills if certain buffs or debuffs are placed on Ferocious Lee and his allies, the type of skills he uses will change. Once Chi runs out, the Chi will accumulate through practice. During that time, the enemy will not sustain as much damage... But since he will not deploy his noble phantasm, so it's best to regroup at this time. When the gauge set's broken, the skill that consumes Qi, qi will uh, also strengthen. There's even a skill that would greatly increase the enemy's death effect for his NP, so prepare accordingly. I don't think they banned... Oh no, it's because we can only have one. Yeah, th we need to go into the proper team, which is of course the Toon Squad. The Toon Squad, yep. Clear, Clear. all. Alright. Castoria, um, I guess she can stay. Uh, Just because I haven't set up my support list. Oh, yeah, that's true. Okay, so. Uh, I'm still grinding in the background here. Yeah. Don't that, worry about me. <laughs> yeah, don't worry about him. I'll have all the focus here. Okay, so we need a saber that can beat down Chi. Um, let's see. What does he have specifically? Does he have anything? I what? think his thing is towards people. Who... No, nah, I was talking more like his... Um, so let's see, he's humanoid, hominid, hominid. he doesn't really have and much. And weak to so Enema much. Illish, but bringing Every Gilgamesh to a lancer fight seems like the worst decision we could yeah. make. Yeah, Abuki is anti-humanoid, so we could go Abuki. Brittlemart is. Brittlemart is? Anti-humanoid? Oh no, all oh. servants have, my bad, let me go down here. Anti-humanoid is oh, Izzo, Izzo and Nightingale. Nightingale, okay, so... Is oh pretty good, but I don't know if he'll I don't, do yeah. it in here. No, so I think we should probably stick with a, a saber for our actual main DPS one. Yeah. Um, I mean, we could always just go when I don't know if something could beat it or not. I usually just go with Nero because mine is NP three. Plus, we already have uh, Castori on the team. Yeah. She'd probably be a safe option here. And I also only have a single damage one. I'm trying uh, to work on getting this one. He's going to work on his when we get there so we can have maybe a second DPSer. All right, so let's see. Um, who would be a support? Who do you feel support-wise here? I'll but say Besides the obvious? Besides the obvious one we have, we need another one here. No, I mean, there's two. Is there? there there's, there is uh, Lady Avalon. <laughs> 
Oh yeah, I guess we can just go Lady Gaga. This one can be our literal test. Let's just use the best, strongest one. Now, let's see. Obviously, we don't need to give her any of these because they're not going to help her at all. So what mm. would actually be good on her? Give her the bunion Z. Give her the bunion Z? <laughs> this one? No, no, no. Give just ten... for the fun of it. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, I don't really think about what she would have because she kind of just sits there and then I, goes back. I feel I, I would kind of... Maybe is there something to give deaf immunity, maybe? There's literally zero. Do they ban it? No, it does. it's not that bad. I don't have them. Well, no, the, the thing is, is that it, it says, watch it go back down. Oh, okay. No, right. yeah, that's what I'm I saying. I thought I it said, it was like, no, you can't do that. What about death resist up? Uh, death, death resist up? Let's see, maybe. Uh, I mean, sure. Sure, yeah. Uh, the only reason I'm not giving her, like, the bigger buff ones is because our team already has that. And also... That's um, uh, two five stars. Yeah. The bat. Yeah, and also Lee has the ability to punch through that so that's why castoria is there yeah okay so let's see our fallout plan we need a saber that will probably get it done a in case saber are or are we gonna go for super sustain man ku colin <laughs> oh yeah i mean we could just get ku i mean literally these are things have gone bad we need to use them as backup uh go here since he already has guts i think it should be fine um, he has guts and an evade. We can just give him some more attack at fifty percent. But that I feel like good. since it's Lee, doesn't he have pierce through the evade anyway? He does, but he has guts, mm, okay. so that that will help out with that. Then we can have another saber for in here. This will probably be the end. The two DPS ones at the back. Excuse me. Whoop! What's going on, <laughs> Lucifer? What are you doing over there? Lucifer, our cat, is currently sitting where our other cat, Luma, stands, and now I feel like he's doing it specifically to mess with us. As he's close like... Close this door, mister. The, well, yeah, they'll make us close this door. I'll go here for a kaleidoscope so you can have an emergency NP shoot-off, and for her, I think, yeah, this one works out. Oh, it's too much. That is too much. Mm, imaginary element, I guess, just so she has access to her... Yeah, I guess that works. Maybe maybe defense up would actually be better in this case. Some bulk. Yeah, he can't pierce through the defense up. Mail mm. and increase. Wait. Okay. Yeah. Th that's fine. It's not the best option, but we'll go with it. All right, we'll see how this goes. Yeah. And let's. Oh, and then the Mystic Code. We're good with keeping. Caldea uniform, decisive battle. Yeah. Mm, unless we want a plug suit for the stun. Can this guy get stunned? Uh, only one way to find out. Go in here. We'll go in here, and we'll see how it goes. Okay. Caldea Tamlin Cup. The next generation. This is the Yu-Gi-Oh! GX of Morgan's Tamlins. If you think you, about you it. think? Yeah. She's like the Kaiba. We haven't seen I'm another like another one since they're her Jaden, I guess. That's because they made a Jaden that's too peak. Bread of Mart too good for this world. That's true. I agree. Okay, so let's see what he's got here. Move Chi trait to apply to various buff for yourself. When defeated, cover HP for yourself when defeating an enemy. Apply two Chi traits. Mm, we don't have actually a pretty good... We don't have a very good... Um, uh, starting lineup? No. No. These cards are I, bad. I, uh, yeah, but I think she could probably... Uh, hmm. But I think she could probably kill, which is Castoria and maybe save the last 30%er. For when there's ones with three cards on her, I think, anyway. Yeah. You know what? We'll, we'll start. You're gonna go guns blazing? At least on the start here. Not full guns, but decent amount of guns. Go there. Go there. Go this one. Okay. And then... Um, Buster and then a quick? Yeah, we'll go here. For, My hope is three. that next she gets uh, three cards of her own. Which is a pretty high chance at this it's point. Trying to find out if this does damage, by the way. <laughs> oh, it should. It'd be funny if it didn't. Oh, yeah. Told you, my girl. Strong. 200%. Almost a million, baby. Now, unfortunately, here's the part where he's gonna completely lay waste into us. No, he, he, he still has one chi. So you got his chi back. See, that was my problem with the... Oh, 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 oh God. God. Bro! So he's only doing the quick one right now. Hmm. 
We have invincibility on her, but I feel like he's gonna do some weird bullshit if we activate that. <laughs> we do, but I feel like we have to activate it. This will also make it so that he can't increase his NP. That's true. Go here. Yay! I could increase her, like, this will increase her um, defense, but then also we lose out on the ability of doing more Haven attribute. But he's not on We the also have to decide here if we want to do Merlin's NP or not, because we do have a full Brave Chain for Nero. We do. I think we should be fine because he doesn't ha he lost the ability of piercing through invincibility, so we should be fine for a single turn. That's fair. At least I think so, anyway. Um, we can also just, um... Gandor him. See if this works, actually. Let's try and Gander. It oh, works. It worked. Okay. So we'll go here. Oh, and man. also, this might get our NP back, hopefully. Hopefully. Alright, Brave Dream. Boom. 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 Bang, bang, bang. Oh. It's not bad. Almost? No, we got it. It back. was pretty close. Basically... I mean, it was pretty close to just straight up murdering him. Yeah. This. Uh... I feel like. No, this is our last turn with all these buffs. It is, but at the same time, do we want to maybe go for the maximum on here then? Yeah. I think so. Go here, here, and then Castoria and prepare for the last turn. Because I feel like he's about to NP one of these girls into Oblivion. Very likely. We just have to hope that it's Lady Avalon. Yes. Alright, let's go. Go here. Boom. Boom, big damage. Damn, you would have basically one chunked his last health bar, I think. Yeah, that's what I was saying. Oh, it's unfortunate how close we got. Yeah. I think we, if we got a couple crits, we would have done it. I think we're still fine because 200% is a lot. <laughs> so, there's, like, he's losing, she's losing 50% of that, but she still has 250. Yeah, he has got some. Oh god, oh god, oh god. So, this is a big hit. Who is he hitting? Please. Oh, oh like, yeah! That's the best case scenario. Boom. But she is dead. <laughs> she is Omega dead. They had to come up with a new name to say how fucking dead she was. Ow. Thank He's you. He's doing the arts now. He is better viewers here. Hello. I'll increase the defense while we can. so out of place. <laughs> Whatever, he's just here to have a good time. He's like, what open I can use this one to heal Castoria a little bit. Yeah, it might be good. Let me see, it is, is... We can switch on. We could. Does she still have the... Damn, she lost it, unfortunate. Um... Switch no, on. this would actually be good because I can use the, um... The second? Yeah, and then go... Here. Yeah. Yeah. Alright. See how this goes. Buster, Buster up. I should have used his other set. It's fine. It's okay. Oh, it removed the key as well. That's right. It removes chi, but I feel like once he's out of chi, he's in like invincible mode. He is. So hopefully this will help out a little bit. Trembling legs. Okay, he's just NP spamming now. Okay, but it's fine because again we have the super Castoria defense up. That's what I was saying. Is like there's no point in investing in invincibility because oh wait a minute. No, there's a chance he still instant kills. That's true. I forgot about that. I was gonna say no. There's plenty to worry. Hmm. Do we want to save Nero Bride here? I think we'll, well, I think we're still fine. And bring in uh, Ibuki. The problem is, is that um, mm, Ibuki's not going to be able to do enough, and this is a full, still a full chain here. I feel like. It's and a, then she's a well. The thing is, is that Ibuki does more Buster stuff. It's true, but this is two hundred percent attack up. That's true. If it was a hundred percent, I would a hundred percent switch her in. But I'll go here, and we just have to hope to God that she lives. And that he chooses to attack someone else. Okay, don't attack. Don't attack her. Oh, oh god damn it. Please. No instant death, no instant death, no instant death. He's dead. No! We should have. We had the guts, but there is a chance that. Okay, he only attacked Bedivere. <laughs> oh, let's go! This is her final stand. This is her last stand, as we all know it. She can deal 800, 1,000 damage, no problem. Hopefully. 
I swear, Lucifer would just be acting up. No You're reason. not on the camera, boy. But at the same time, he went for water this time. So maybe I'm like a little lenient. That's why I didn't get up. I can't believe he lived through that. <laughs> he lived through that, but this is his last chi. This is his last chi. Is he going to go He's after He's gonna go Nero? after her. Okay, thank 100%. Goodness. If it was Castoria, I'd be like, okay, that's not the greatest. That would be very bad. He, oh, he got his chi back because he killed someone. Yeah, so he has his, he has it back. So I can bring in... We can tend... I can, I can just bring in... Ibuki. Yeah, go from here, and then she'll be able to use her. So she has guard against that. Interesting. Okay, go here. That is, here. That, he definitely has to be dead here. I think it's a Buki first and then Bedivere last. No, doesn't Bedivere give uh, increases your war buster? Okay, yeah, okay. So yeah, I'll go here, here, here. That and also should... because it's a single target. NG. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And mine's MP5, I think. Mm -hmm. Which snakes? Snake. This might kill me still. So. Oh. Pretty close. He has to be like this, at oh, well, well almost. I mean, that's the problem with um, AOE NPs. Real close, very all right. Close. Real close, very, we're very fine. Close. He's gonna get some help though. He still has a guts, no? No, I think his guts is gone. Oh god. Kupal okay. and his rod. This is very annoying. Yeah. Okay. Go here. I guess the best we got here is go here. And then the two busters. Yeah. He might live on principle that he kills another person. I mean, it's possible. But this should prevent him from doing anything. From killing, at least, for this single turn. No. Yeah, no, it stops. Well, I, the the instant death thing is probably the bigger issue. I can't even tell if I killed her or not. I could not tell either. <laughs> She's too tall. I'll be 100% real and say I did not know if that killed or not. Well, we have a full uh, cool thing. We do have a full cool. Because I can try doing that. Because that will increase his defense. We don't have any attack thing. We use that. Yep. I feel like with the other plug suit, we would have uh, did a bit better because mm. we had the NP strengthen up on both of them. Maybe. We'll see. Yeah, he's about to like booty blast one of them. Oh, he dodged it completely. All right, so. So he's on his weird. This should. No, he has a weird defense thing. I see now. He didn't. No, he doesn't. Unable to use, delayed. No, Gain don't. resistance to all attacks. Oh my god. The most annoying man in the world. I'll go here then. And see. See what happens. You can try the Gale Bolg, but I don't know if it's gonna do it. If, it, if, it, if it really does do less damage, then it just doesn't make any sense to do it right now. Yeah. Wait, I basically have to outlive and wait. And hope that he keeps just targeting a Buki. He did not target a Buki. There's his health back. Yep, there's his health back. But now. He still has it. Still, but now it's just nothing but pure Abuki. And I feel like. Once Ku dies here, which is very close. Not he can't. He can't yet. I thought. Uh, let me see. Is his thing gone? Yeah, it's gone now. He has his chi back. And of course, when it does it, that's when Ku is up for fucking bat. This is very annoying. <laughs> we had like the worst card selection in the world. So are we brave chaining or are we quick chaining? We can't. Uh, we can't quick. Ch I mean, the quick chain doesn't do anything. Yeah, that's why I'm asking you. Kinda... 
That's not her NP. No, but it'll give yeah, some crit, crit stars. Star stuff. I guess we go for Mighty Chain here. Oh, I guess not. I can just go double buster and hope for the best. You could. Let's see. There we go. It is not gonna do anywhere. He would have to. He has to hit Ku with this, and then. Well, no, I don't know. I don't know about that. It has to hit Ku, and then from that point on, it's a Buki trying to survive it. If he hits a Buki, it's over. Because it steals enough damage to kill her instantly. We would have had a chance if it was literally anyone else. Alright, this one we're gonna do again because we literally got fucked over by the worst card placements in the history of the world. We had him dead for rights from the beginning. This is how it should have went. This is how it should have went, This yes. video shouldn't have been this long. It should not have been this long. If he had just done the, the right thing and simply died. Laid down his arms and die. Yes. To the Roman Emperor. Should have been the right way of doing it. You're probably right that using the invincibility and the random evade that we did not need probably hurt more. Uh, I can actually probably look right here. Let's see, 0% death rate, so you can't instant kill him. He has two stacks, he will cast. That's his thing for yeah. he's in. At the, every turn, mercilessly will cast a unique skill. See the table below to consume one stack. So 5% grants self three stacks of chi, and then 500% chance of grants self That's his break bar oh. stuff, yeah. Uh, ignore invincibility. If the part, oh yeah, if the party has invincib evasion or invincibility, he gets that after that. But if Mercilessly has Skill Seal or MP Seal, he also gets this. So he could then, have had another Guts. But then no, if he has neither of them, he still charges his MP to the max. Weird. So no matter what, he was always going to be slapping us with MPs. The only thing that changed was that he gained the ability to ignore invincibility. And I think the Guts thing is something that naturally happens. Yes. Yeah. Because we didn't have a Skill Seal or MP Seal thing. Grand self and that one's only chance. 50. Man. Well, been good to know. Alright, that's the first one. That's a clear. Only because I felt like we could have easily beaten that one. <laughs> but we just got unlucky with never drawing a single Bride Nero thing in the first one two times in a row. But that's one down. Feel free to tell us how you did. And we'll see you guys in the next one. Say goodbye, boy. Goodbye.